LaTeX is great for typing math. And one of the things that you'll probably most often be doing in math is superscript or subscripts, x squared or y sub i, y sub j, whatever. Uh, in this lesson, I'm going to show you how to do some basic superscripts and subscripts in math. The comments really say it all. Put math in dollar signs. So let's, uh, here is some math. And we'll type x squared and y sub k. Okay. Um, we use the caret for a superscript, and we use the underscore for subscript. So let's typeset this. Of course, the comments won't show up. Only the thing that we actually typed will show up. And when I zoom in, we'll see that we have x squared and yk, y sub k. Um, if you want to do something like x to the 10th or y sub ijk, you need to use curly braces to enclose everything that you want to subscript. So here's an example. Um, subscripts and superscripts. So dollar signs, x to the, let's do it, x to the 1, 2, 3 power, and let's do y sub uh, ijk. And we'll click typeset. And there you can see x to the 1, 2, 3, and y to the ijk. Now watch what happens if I don't include those curly braces. Okay, Pay careful attention to the uh, x to the 1, 2, 3, and y to the ijk. I removed the curly braces, and I press typeset. And notice how x to the 1 is superscripted, but the 2, 3 is regular. And y to the i is subscripted, but the jk um, is regular letters. So I have to make sure that I put those in curly braces. And of course, I will typeset again so that you can see the difference. Watch carefully. And now everything is right. I can also mix and match. So let's say I want to do like x squared sub i, or doing the more advanced stuff, I could do like maybe z to the um, 1, 2, 3 sub abc. And I'll press typeset. And watch what happens. So let's mix and match. x squared sub i, z to the 1, 2, 3 power, sub abc. And that's pretty much it.